I am Goose. I'm Logan. We're at Toss It. So people have been like saying, hey Goose, Logan, you should go try and find something healthier, healthier to eat. <laughs> uh, so we were looking around, we were looking for like some vegan foods, vegetarian mm -hmm. food, and someone suggested toss it. So we're on our way inside to uh, go check it out. Yep. All right, so what'd you get? The strawberry chicken wrap. Ooh. Got it right here. Oh. That looks, so that looks about as big as a burrito. Mm -hmm. Usually when you get wraps, they're like, you know, like half that size. Mm -hmm. That looks humongous. Oh, and it looks like it's gonna be good. It looks like it's gonna be good. I got, I built my own salad. And I had like a spring, spring mix with chicken and bacon and black beans and I threw in, had them throw in some blue cheese and, and some pineapple and cranberries. And, Almonds, and I think this all looks delicious. And I had them when they asked me to, if I, you know, when the with the dressing, they go, "Do you want some cider?" I said, "Throw it in there." So they mixed it all in there. It looks really good. So time to eat. Your first thought? It's really good. Okay. Now, when I first heard of like strawberry chicken, I didn't think it'd be a good mix, but it just enough like I guess weird enough to pique my interest. Hmm. So I tried it. And it's super good. They might not work well. Like, you might not think they'd work well together. It, it does. They do. Now the strawberries, I'm going to ask. It's also got cranberries. It's also got I think, onion. And See a little bit of tomato in there. Mm -hmm. Now, is it, you know, is it like fresh strawberries? or? Oh, yeah. And I mean, I, I, mean, I got some chicken in mine. Mine is mm -hmm. you know, pretty fresh for chicken. So. so. And you got what? No, what did you you said you got a what kind of tortilla is that? Spinach. A spinach tortilla. Yep. I didn't even know they even made spinach tortillas. Neither did I. But <laughs> once I saw they had a spinach tortilla, I was like, yeah, that's what I want to try. That's what to try. Mm -hmm. This is really good. They really threw this together pretty well. Um, again, this, I mean, it's got chicken. Also, this, this also has artichoke hearts, black olives, it's got pineapple. Anyway, and that's the thing about you know when when you build your salad. It's like the, you, you get a choice between romaine and a spring mix. You get um, a, you get a choice of three proteins, five toppings, you know, and this just really, really works. This is really good. I'm very, very happy. So for all those people out there who are trying to keep their New Year's resolutions together as far as health and weight and everything, they sit there and they say, well, I can't find a restaurant that will where I can you know, eat healthy and for a good price. I have to make the difference. I think there are restaurants out there that you can actually go and find. Mm -hmm. Tossit's one of them. I mean, if you've ever seen our channel, we don't normally like run to the, 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 health, health, food. the health food aisle. Um, but more and more people were like say, hey, we want to see if you guys you know, do some more. Vegetarian, you know, healthier options. You know, vegan options. I mean, it's interesting because you can't get your vegan options here too. It's like mm -hmm. you don't have to get not just vegetarians. I mean, I like chicken, so I'm, I'm always going to get mm -hmm. a chicken salad. Yeah, but even for the proteins, they have non-meat options. Yeah, they have non-meat, tofu, and beans, and stuff. So, mm -hmm. so you know, this is a good place to start for us because, again, if, if you don't think you can keep your New Year's resolutions as far as weight and health and everything, they're out there. Right now, Toss It, I think, is one of the, the better options for you to choose. This is really good food. Yeah. I'll give you another shot of the inside of this strawberry chicken wrap. And it is amazing. One thing I forgot to mention is it also has walnuts in it. So, beware for all our nut allergic viewers. But it is delicious. It's also got raspberry vinaigrette, and mm. it's amazing. So, why don't you get one more shot of this? I want to just show you. Like, look at the big, big pieces of artichoke here. Nice big pieces of pineapple. Bacon, nuts, cranberries. This all work, work really well. And again, I built this so you get to choose your ingredients. 
you know, aside from the fact that I built my salad, they do have salads that they're already that they that, that they have on the menu that mm -hmm. they can make a cob salad, Asian salad, a strawberry chicken, strawberry, like I yeah, got. like you got wraps. Uh, right now, they, 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 one thing they do have they have a taco salad. They only serve mm -hmm. on Tuesdays. So if you're here at Toss It on Tuesdays, you get your, 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 get your taco salad. Right now, Logan and I are right now waiting for uh, a couple for of our juices, our juices. Tropicali and the Kickstarter. Kickstarter. So hopefully those will be getting very soon. Mm -hmm. We're going to finish up with our, uh, our salads, our salads and, and our wraps and uh, get right back to you. We just got our juices. So they come with some nice little fun tops. This is the... Mm -hmm. That's the Tropicali. That's the Tropicali. Nice yeah. orange there. This is the Kickstarter here. Now what is it? What's inside the Tropicali? It's got pineapple, banana, uh, pineapple, spinach, orange, and banana. Okay. Good okay. remember. The Kickstarter has got orange, strawberries, spinach, but uh, bananas, and carrots. Carrots. So we're going healthy today. Mm -hmm. So I hate to break it in your face, but it's time to do it. Oh no, stabbed him in the face. <laughs> oh, gonna lose an eye, bro. Ah, I can't see. Promoting violence. <laughs> your first thought on you just. Really interesting. Very good. Very good. What's the predominant taste? Predominant taste? I can't put my tongue out of it. It tastes familiar. <laughs> He's gonna look back at the ingredients. Somewhere up there. I think the prevailing flavor is the orange. Orange. But except for it's also got spinach and banana and pineapple. She's gonna try Bars your up. Kickstarter. Oh yeah, I can really taste the orange in this. Mm -hmm. Nice good, nice little bite to it. Nice mm -hmm. little kick to it. Pretty good. Again, I'm not into like juicy juices or stuff, but unless they come out of a cart that says, mm -hmm. you know, sun kissed. Yeah. But um, this is actually pretty good. Mm -hmm. I, you know, I know a lot of people that are mm -hmm. they're into like juicing and stuff to cleanse their bodies. And one thing is they make these fresh. Fresh, so right? It's here. cool to get all these. You can actually hear mixing everything together. Yeah, it's really good. It is. Dude, you got a big, you like about half a chicken in there. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I took another bite of my strawberry chicken. I looked in there, it's a giant. That's the way to do it, chicken. dude. That is the way to do it. Mm -hmm. See, I'm almost done with my salad here. This was really good. And again, the, the idea of being able to make your own salad is kind of like almost like the same concept of like Subway. You make your own mm -hmm. sandwiches. Make your own sandwich. Yeah, and this is really good. And I mean, just, I know I got you with your mouth full, but mm -hmm. just, this seems like a really good place to get you like, a light mm -hmm. meal. You downtown working and you don't even eat anything heavy, you just mm -hmm. greasy or like, you know, just a nice alternative to the, to the norm. Mm -hmm. And we were talking with them, we were like, how, how long have you guys been here? And they're like, they said they've been here five years. And I said, I didn't even know this place was here until I was looking, I'm like, uh, healthy restaurants near me and this popped up. Yeah. It was, it's like this this place is not very big. Mm -hmm. what, what, what do we use to call them? A little hole in the wall. A little hole in the wall. You know, as well as it's surrounded by a lot of popular restaurants, popular restaurants. like Gin Sushi, Sandrini's Public House. Tina, Tina Marie's, mm -hmm. you know, so. But this is really good. I mean, it's just, this place is like it's not very big. I've probably about, seen about 20 people mm -hmm. inside. And they had a little patio outside, but this mm -hmm. is. Yeah, we declined to eat outside because it's been raining all day. Yeah, all it's cold. People get cranky when it gets cold. Yeah. Yep. I'm gonna give you one last shot of this strawberry chicken wrap before I finish it up. And I also forgot to mention that the type of cheese they have in here is goat cheese. Goat cheese? That's an interesting mix up from your regular cheddar or mozzarella. Or yeah, cheese. I mean, I, whenever I have a salad, I, either, I go for either like blue cheese mm -hmm. or feta cheese. Yeah, because blue cheese is actually what you got on your. Uh, yeah, I got I actually got your chunks of blue cheese and I put mm -hmm. had blue cheese dressing put on it. And it's, it's weird. It's, it's you know, uh, you would think that, you know, some dressing makers or whatever 
would like mm -hmm. put chunks of blue cheese in their dressing, but that's what I usually like to do. Mm -hmm. um, it's either for me, it's either feta or, or blue cheese, but I've never had goat cheese. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, but just, it's really good. Yeah, it's really good. Mm -hmm. Nice. Yes, this strawberry chicken wrap is excellent. So, if you ever decide to come to toss it, I highly recommend. But I'm surprisingly full. I am too. Uh, you know, I, I was joking, you know. I always talk about going into food comas from Mexican food, and I yeah. didn't think you'd go into a food coma from a salad. But uh, yeah, I, I didn't think so either, but apparently you can. It was it was really good. It, it was uh, excellent. Uh, and the, the juices were, were just mm -hmm. phenomenal. Uh, I can see why people kind of get hooked on that stuff. Oh, yeah. Um, so Toss It is here over on I Street, right near, what is it, 19th? And uh, it's right behind Jin Sushi. Right, right Jin Sushi. Find. It's not a very big place. You will drive right by it if you don't know it's there. Yeah, as um, we were saying, it's been here five years and we didn't know it was here we didn't until know it was today. Here. Uh, but it, it's it's a great little place to get some really healthy food. And uh, the, the salad and the wrap came out to about 30 bucks. Mm -hmm. And one of the juices the came out. juices came out about 16. So wow. they were they were seven fifty each. So it might be a little pricey, but it is freshly made yeah, I, I say it's I, well worth done it. I think it's well worth the price mm -hmm. to keep yourself on that uh, New Year's resolution, resolution track diet. yeah so Logan if they want to check us out anywhere else where they go if you want to find all the links to our social medias you can find them at withkoji.com slash at travel by nature then you can find the links to our podcasts our Instagram for travel by nature yep. our TikTok yep we also have an Ask Me Anything tab and a tip jar, if you're so generous. Yeah, check out some of our other channels. I'm with the show, Wrestling Boys. Miss Cindy's Kitchen. Yeah, we, we're, we're, we're putting together a nice little... Uh, Breakfast series right now. Yeah, so it's pretty good. And Logan, if they want to help out the channel, what do they do? You can hit the like button, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and share to your friends. Yeah, share it out to your friends. Leave us a comment. It makes us smile. So here from Toss It, over here on 19th and I... I'm Goose. I'm Logan. This is Travel by Nature. Thank you for watching.